Hello there, my dear and bright students. This is your teacher Shukufta Faisal and today we will talk about computers, especially binary computers. So first of all, let's have a look on the history of the computers. A computer is an electronic machine that accepts information, uh, data, uh, and processes it according to the specific instructions and provides the result as new information. So basically, this is the desktop computer and look at the formation. It has a system unit, it has a keyboard to give information, uh, it has input devices, output devices, you know, things like that. So this is a proper and a complete uh, definition of computer. Look at this ancient counting machine which we call Abascus. And we were using these Roman numerals or Arabic numerals. This is also one mechanical counting machine, the Pascaline. It is a mechanical calculating device invented by a French philosopher. One another mechanical counting machine, which was punch card. Punch cards were used by the French weaver Joseph Jacquard in 1810. The cards carried weaving instructions for the looms. Later this idea offered a great use for storing information. Here is mechanical counting machine. Babbage different uh, engines were calculating machines made by Charles Babbage to produce tables of numbers. This device had mechanical problems similar to those that plugged Pascal and Leibniz. The electrical counting machine. The United States census of the 1880 took nine years to compile and led to the inaccurate figures. To solve the problem, Herman Holler invented a calculating machine that used electricity along with punch card instead of mechanical gear. Based on the success of this invention, Herman Holler and uh, some uh, friends formed a company that sold his invention all over the world. Now this company name is IBM. So guys, this was the history of computer and what we were using in the past. Thank you.